We go to the Mile High City, Denver Nuggets hosting the Phoenix Suns. Early fourth quarter, Eric Bledsoe, the Kentucky product, showing off the bounce. Absolutely embarrassing Kenneth Fareed. Puts him on a poster, 28 on the night for Bledsoe. Later in the fourth, Danilo Gallinari taking it to the rim. And he's going hard with two hands. Stuffing it on TJ Warren. Big time highlight by Gallinari. He had 25 and seven. Nikola Jokic, the second year man. He's been so effective. Gets his own board in the putback. There would be more from Jokic in the fourth quarter. On the defensive end, tries to block the Devin Booker shot. Looks like he may have taken a knee to the thigh. He was in pain. Jokic, 29 points, 14 rebounds. After the game, some positive news. He was seen walking under his own power after getting his hip x-rayed. The Nuggets do win. Jokic has been phenomenal, averaging about maybe 24 per game in January. If he was out for an extended period of time, that would be a big loss for the Nuggets. No doubt. Yeah, he's, he's playing better, and the Nuggets are sort of playing better during this stretch where Emmanuel Moutier has been absent. Uh, Malone did, Coach Malone did say after this game that Moutier will not be out for much longer, maybe a game. Denver has a lot of good pieces. They're a market where you're probably not going to attract a lot of free agents, and they're doing a decent job. They're still a few years away. But I think we're going to start thinking Jokic in the conversation of Carl Anthony Towns and Kristaps Porzingis. Yep. Uh, I just wonder maybe if him being in Denver, since it's not a great yeah. market, maybe that holds him back a little bit from getting the recognition he deserves. Yeah, we'll see. I mean, uh, I think that, like, you know what? Gordon Hayward is a free agent this year, Yep. right? Um, and we'll see where Jokic develops the next year or two. But I'm curious what Utah does. Do they throw Mike Conley money at him? Because what is their alternative? At some point, at least th what the benefit is, if we draft and grassroot you, we can at least offer an additional year or at least a larger More amount of money, money than yeah. any other team. And with the cap expanding, we're talking $35 million over the course of a five-year period. Kind Hard of what your, your man Cousins is with Sacramento. It's going to be a bridge they're going to cross with the reports of what his contract's going to be. And that's really the only way it's going to happen. I mean, it's why we saw Oklahoma City have three of the six best players and still mess it up. Right now for Denver, though, they are clinging to that eighth seed. We'll see if they can hold on, and we'll continue to monitor the status of Yoke.